Okay, this video here is of the motor of the Kosho 1000 I have listed. Um, it's a Kosho Jetstream 1000. Uh, just needs to be all put together. I'm not sure what size the motor is. That's the motor there. I got her set up. Uh, I'm going to fire it up. Let it run, as you can see. Uh, let's see here. You gotta have the glow warmer. Stick that on there. Uh, just hold it down here a minute. See if I can do this. Been running a while, but <laughs> got a pinch of fuel line off to shut it off, as you can see. But uh, it's a good running motor, runs good. And you see, once you get everything on there, and <laughs> pinch the fuel line off, shut it off, and it's uh, what I know of the engine. It's a good runner. Uh, Full start. It's got everything on there. Flywheel if you want to put a belt on for uh, electric start. Um, everything, as far as I know, is uh, pretty much there. Uh, all the parts are inside the lower unit or out drive. The other mount is on the back of the boat. Uh, these here are servo mounts. They go down in there. Uh, water cooling line for the pickup. Fuel tank. Um, there is the steering. Uh, servo horn and steering rods. Um, uh, if you look real close here by the motor mount, you can see there's a small crack there. These are new uh, rubber grommets here I purchased and then installed. Was going to put together and just don't have the time no more. Um, there's a small crack here, just real minor imperfection cracks or whatnot around the edges there and there. Uh, some more small ones here. Um, on the back here, it uh, appears to have had trim tabs on it at one time. Here and here. Um, would probably have to seal them holes up, uh, put her together, get a radio system, uh, and run it. Uh, I do have a good, uh, Fataba system online listed as well. If you want to purchase that to go with it, um, we'll go back to the engine one more time. Put on the glow warmer. And she's been setting for a little bit, make sure she ain't revving up. And see if she'll start. <laughs> As you can see, fired right up. Uh, don't want to run it too long because it'll get hot and we don't want it overheating. So, 
I guess that's it for the engine uh, for the Jetstream 1000.